Alright everyone, Maryland here, and this time we're gonna go on south to Route 21. Now, if you have not been to Route 22 after beating the gym, you need to go there now because you need the Colrus machine in order to go much further. It's vital in order to uh, proceed. So, if you haven't done that already, make sure you go get it now, trainer! Anyway, here's Route 21. It's a solely aquatic route. There's not really a lot of interesting Pokemon here. In fact, there's only three you can find in the normal water. Frillish, Mantike, and Remoraid. And don't get too excited about Remoraid either because, surprise, it's only a 5% chance of encountering it. You can find a Mantine if you're lucky, but only in the rippling water. And only 5% of the time as well, so. Catch this, my Pokemon is huge! <laughs> oh, no, it's really getting huge. Alright, Swimmer Desire. Desire? I don't even know. Whoa! She wasn't kidding. That thing is enormous! It's another Wailord. Oh, what are you doing out here, Vesuvian? I don't think this is a good idea. Let's switch for someone a little safer, like uh, Scaleaf here. There we go. That's so much better. Dive. Dive! 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 You sunk my battleship! <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna use Coil because there's nothing I can do when it's diving. Nope, nothing. But I'll uh, take that opportunity to raise my stats a little bit. Alright, let's Leaf Blade. Slash, yeah! Oh yeah! Now, one thing I did do, I, um, I took a quick trip off camera just to rename my Mean Foo that I put onto my team in the last episode. I named him Sakurai. I know, you're probably wondering, what? Why? Well, it's just, I think, like, the origin of the name is, um, oh, Cherry Blossom Well or something like that. It's kind of like, I mean, if it would have been a female, I would have, oh, uh, what? You're a trainer? Awesome, come on, my Ren Raid. Now, if it would have been a female, I probably would have named her Sakura because it's, like, Cherry Blossom, and even though it's probably the most overused Japanese name, uh, <laughs> at least, you know, if you're American like me, you just want to call everything Sakura. But it actually fits with it, because, you know, why are you still out here, Vesuvian? You know what, just get this done. Oh, there was a good move, staying in. Oh! Naturally. Really. <laughs> oh, I hate this game sometimes. <laughs> Yeah, but I figure, okay, Sakurai's close enough, and my mean foo is a dude. Oh yeah, look at me, I'm gonna hit five, oh, four times. And I'm gonna hit myself too. Oh wow, I used, I finally used it, I don't believe it. Well that went smooth. <laughs> no, it didn't. Alright, let's, uh, let's send out... Let's send out Sakurai. Let's just try him out. Now, unfortunately, he has six levels to go before he'll be useful and evolve. But you still got some moves. Let's do, uh... Let's go for the jump kick. Well, that's good news. I didn't miss on my first try. <laughs> that's never a good sign. Oh, well, time for my Remoraid to return to their Pokeballs. Yeah... About that. Um, okay. Sort these items really quick here and use a Moo Moo Milk. Alright, there we go. Vesuvian, I am switching you out, pal. I know you're brave. Well, actually, I don't think you are brave. I think you are... hasty. We're gonna send out America! Because I haven't used him for too long. I mean, I used them a little bit in the last episode, I think, but not long enough. And even though grass and electric types are your best bet while traveling down here, because it's a solely aquatic route, um, you know, you can mix it up. No big deal. Oh, he has an artillery! Yikes, level 46. Well, hopefully a well-placed return will do the trick. Thankfully, this thing is pretty slow. And it doesn't have good defense. <laughs> there we go. Thanks for teaching me a lesson. Yeah, I taught you a lesson. 
darn kid. Did I? I think I used the super repel. Haven't run into any Pokemon, let me put it to you that way. So, south here, you'll find a black belt guy. Just chilling. You have to fight him in order to go through. Hiya! Hiya! I'm practicing my punching technique in front of the sea! Give it a try! Uh, no, I'm good, thanks. Huh, huh, huh. Uh, ooh, Crustal, yikes. Not a good matchup right now. I think, uh, I think it'd be a pretty good time to switch out. Let's see. Um. Oh, man. I'm trying to think here. Well, let's go with, uh, let's go with Magneto and hope this thing isn't going to use Earthquake or something. I don't think it will. <laughs> That'd be pretty silly. Shell smash. Oh no! That can get ugly pretty fast. Yikes. Uh, I'm gonna flash cannon this thing and- Oh no, it's faster than me! Thanks to shell smash. Hopefully it doesn't have sturdy. I just want to take this thing out one hit. Please. Darn it. Ugh. Ah, uh, you would get a critical hit. <laughs> I don't get it. I just don't. I won't stop punching just because I lost. Never stop punching. Never surrender. Use another Moo Moo Milk. Thank goodness these things are cheap. Ugh. All right. Well, that was just unpleasant. Let's go surf to the north. Move around here. This is a very boring route. Ooh, an item. Big pearl. Yay, I got a big pearl, guys. All right, let's keep going. See, here we are on the other side of her. Uh, actually, I guess you could surf around here to totally avoid that black belt if you wanted. You see this enormous puddle? They call it an ocean. <laughs> Oh man, this puddle is huge! I totally called it a puddle. So, Swimmer Kyle, he has a Wingull on his team. Well, I've got a giant bird. Look at this thing. It puts that Wingull to shame. Yeah! Don't like that now, do ya? Oh, he has another Wingull on his team. Wow. Uh, we'll just stick with you, that's fine. No big deal. There we go. Alright, this guy is gone. Whoa, you're enormous too! <laughs> hey, that's not very nice. Okay, so... Uh, yeah. As you can see, we've, uh, we've arrived. There is a cave over there, but we're not going to be able to get to it at this point. Nope. Uh, no, not right now. I'll decide when I get into the cave. So, before you head in, you might want to fight this doctor guy. He'll heal up your Pokemon, which uh, is pretty nice. It saves you a trip all the way back to the Pokemon Center. You just have to take out his Alomomola first. Level 46. Shouldn't be too difficult or anything, other than, you know, the part where it loves to use annoying moves on you. Like pretty much every Alomomola out there, because that's about all they do. Okay, well, it's gonna wish. Yeah. Took that thing out, no problem. Gained some good experience. Yay, Sakurai, level 45. Um. I don't need Quick Guard. It's good. I see! What energetic Pokémon! Yeah! Okay, I'll replenish your Pokémon's energy. Why, thank you, kind sir! Everything's okay now, come back anytime. Well, maybe I will. So over here, you can pick up this PP up right, right here. And uh, you can also fight this fisherman guy. 
I'll have a battle with you using my freshly caught Pokemon. Sure, why not? I like fresh and freshly caught Pokemon. He's got a Frillish, level 44, which is regrettably something I can't hit with return. So I think I'll just use Fly and hope it doesn't do anything nasty while I'm up in the air. Rain Dance, make it rain! Uh, yeah, you can do that. See if I care. Boom! Oh no, Cursed Body! You disabled my fly. Alright, well. Another Frillish. And it's raining out, so... I think I'm actually going to use... Oh, man. I'm gonna use Scale Leaf here. Just gonna hope I don't get Cursed Bodied again. Shut down my Leaf Blade. That'd be a real rip. Oh, now this one's a female Frillish. See, they have different colors depending on their gender. And another one. Alright, uh, I'll leave you out. It's all good. Ah, this one's female as well. Cool. I had no how I had no idea how my Pokemon would fight. Well, should have thought about that before, shouldn't you? Anyway, right here is the entrance to the Seaside Cave, which we'll check out in the next episode of Maryland's Pokemon White 2 Adventure. See you next time, trainers.